Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. So, is the Mac Mini worth it? Asked by QVSL here in the uh, live chat as we're streaming TLDR live onto YouTube. Uh, I, I'm not going to say that it was my first Mac. It was probably uh, my first modern Mac, uh, you know, an up-to-date Mac, um, or somewhat up-to-date. My previous Mac was an old iMac, the, the lamp one. I was just, I, I got that as just kind of say, hey, well, is it, this is kind of interesting. It's kind of fun. It's a little uh, toy. You know, got to play with different software. But is the Mac Mini worth it? Some would say no. Some would. And you could argue, uh, rightfully so, that no, it's not worth it. Uh, if all you want to do is browse the web and check email and play games, uh, and if you want a small form factor, you could probably save a little bit of money uh, by getting another computer and not going with a Mac Mini. That's, that's, I'm going to throw that out there. I mean, it is an absolute truth. Um, but is a Mac Mini worth it? That was the question. If you are looking for a small device, a uh, very small computer plug-in, uh, that you, know, you can compute with, you know, for lack of a better word, if you want to get your first Mac, uh, the Mac Mini is a good starter. Baseline, good starter. Under $1,000, well under $1,000. Uh, you can configure it and, and you know, add uh, memory to it. Uh, you know, change capacity, change uh, processor speed. You can you can change all those things, or configure it, or buy it. You know, as a as a uh, preassembled at, at a store, or, you know, an online retailer. Um, I'm not going to say it's the gateway Mac, but in many ways, it, I, I think it was for me because I didn't. I, I thought, oh, it's kind of cool. I mean, it's r really neat, and it's as far as Macs were concerned, in, in the in the form factor, I didn't need much more at that point. And so as I, I started to use it more and more, I was, I was realizing, oh, this is kind of neat. I really like the software I'm finding, and, and it's the software that's available for Mac OS X, a lot of free stuff. Um, I, uh, I was really figuring out how to work it into my normal workflow beyond you know, using Windows. Uh, and I, used, I had that Mac Mini for a, a couple of years, uh, really, before, and I used it every day, uh, before uh, I started to replace more of my computers with Max, largely because of the experience I had. It was a really good experience. And it was so affordable uh, in terms of Max. Someone say, it's not affordable in terms of PCs. Yeah, you're right. You're, you're absolutely right. Um, if you want to just surf the web and check email, no, it's probably not for you. But if you want to surf the web, check email on Mac OS X, then yes, it is for you. If you want a Mac that is less than $1,000, it's a good one to go with. Although now I would probably say you might consider getting a MacBook Air right around the $1,000 price point, but then you can pick it up, carry it around. You get the screen built in, the keyboard and everything. Um, some people run their uh, web server on a Mac Mini. The live stream at live.perillo.com has been running on a Mac Mini since I started it. A few years ago, uh, that Mac Mini has evolved. I still have that one, actually. I've been looking to sell it, but I can't. I, I don't know how much money I can necessarily fetch for that Mac Mini. It's like a core duo. It's not even a core two duo. Uh, the one I've got now, I think is. I think it is a core two, duo. It's been a while since I've looked at its innards. I mean, it, it works. I have not upgraded the Mac Mini yet, although I've been thinking about getting uh, one with the uh, an i5 processor if only to help handle a lot of the video stuff that, that well its primary role it's really its only role is to push out the live video feed it's that's what it does um, and, and, and certainly I'm, I'm happy with it I don't know if anybody wants to make a, a bid for my original live stream Mac mini which is a, a few years old I the specs are probably nowhere near what you would want them to be uh, but if you want to have that computer to say hey I have Chris Perillo's original Mac mini streaming computer thing uh, I'd be interested in possibly parting ways with it. I, I'm not attached to uh, you know any particular computer. If something happens to it, I'll replace it. No problem there. Oh. So uh, you know the bottom line is it depends on what you're looking for. Uh, I wouldn't recommend it to everybody, um, but you've got my uh, personal my personal perspective. I'm making no money on the transaction. Apple actually kicked me out of their affiliate program. <laughs> Seriously. How's that for a kick in the crotch? Thanks, Apple. Really appreciate it. I think everybody would appreciate that end of the video, too, because they think, oh, you're a fanboy. Yeah, really. Well, Apple doesn't believe so.
Here's my answer. What's yours?